Today we're gonna do a ton of research, specifically Burmy researches, which are very easy. All you have to do is catch five Pokemon. And you get a random Burmy and they are shiny boosted. And quite frankly, it only took me seven of them to get my first shiny. So let's see what happens with these ones. Maybe we'll get lucky and get more shinies and we wanna get a potential Shundo. And for that number, we need a 209, but so far we're not even in the 200s. But this one right here is gonna not do it. Oh, that was close though, 208. But yeah, it'd be kind of fun to try to get ourselves a potential Shundo. You never know, it could happen. And plus there's boosted combies out there. I've been having a a lot of luck when it comes down to Nankata. So today we're just gonna go out there and grind as much as we can and who knows, maybe we'll get our hands on a really good shiny. Like this one. This one would have been an amazing shiny. Three more chances. Let's see if we can get a shiny here. Number one is not a shiny and a 194. To be honest with you, I don't even care which Burmy actually becomes the potential Shundo. I just want it to be a male because I really want to get a Shundo Motham. I think that would be super cool, but so far no shinies. Three more chances. We're gonna start at the bottom here. This one's going to be a not shiny and a 192. Come on, 209 with a slightly bluish tech. 203 though. Six off the hundo with that one. This one also isn't it. And another 203. Okay. Gonna start from the middle on these ones. I'm feeling the middle, though I didn't feel it right. It's not a shiny. 199 as well isn't great, but this one is a 192. And this top one is a sandy one that is a 197. I honestly didn't think this was gonna be our first shiny of the day, but I'll take it. It's a fun one. Shiny Dwebble doesn't change too much. It gets a little darker, but on the upside, it also has a little green spot on the corner of its shell. But when it evolves, it turns like fully green. It really changes when it evolves. Kinda wish that Dwebble was that full limey green though. But let's see how good this one is. 708 is a 10116. Not bad all in all. You've got three more here, but as you can see in the middle, this one is not an event task, but it is still a Burmy task. You have to catch five grass or bug types, which works during a bug out event and definitely works during an event where you only have to catch five Pokemon anyways for the other ones. So let's click this one and see what happens. It's not it and a 193. The top one is not going to be blue. Yep, I knew it. But this bottom one, that's the one, right? Haha, <laughs> no, it's not. Okay, 199. Let's see what this one has for us. It does not have a shiny, 192. Last time it only took a seven in the video to get it, and now we're just way past seven. How about this one right here? Nope, not it, 202. Middle first with these three, we get ourselves a 97. Top one is going to become a not shiny with a 194. And the bottom one, oh, is a shiny, and a 19, or 19, wow, a 198. Well, so far we've gotten ourselves a shiny trash cloak here, and in the previous video we got the leafy cloak shiny, so yeah, pretty cool all in all. Technically we'd only need to get the sandy cloak and we would be officially done if you don't include the genders and all that stuff for the evolutions. But anyway, it's cool to get this one and it is a female, so this would become a Wormadam and it is a 12, 13, 15. Not bad, all things considered. Well, this isn't quite the bird we were looking for on the daily, but I will take it. It's also been a while since I've gotten a shiny Spearow. I used to get these like literally all the time. Don't know why, it's just like Rattata. It seems to really like me. And apparently it still likes me, which is nice, I guess. But now we've caught it. Who knows, maybe we daily incensed a really good one. This one right here has 15 attack. That's pretty cool. 15, 7, 14. Not our best shiny of the day, but it's pretty up there. Let's see if the next batch can give us another shiny. This is a Sandy 207. That would have been a really good one. You are not shiny and a 201. And last but not least, we got our hands on a trash cloak that is a 19-4. Oh my god, I can't even talk today. 194. Three 12 Ks. Let's see what we get from them. A yellow sand dial would be cool, but that's a poniard. Number two is a Vullaby. And this final egg is a Another Vullaby. Let's see what we get from these three. You are a Trash Burmy, 194, followed up by a Sandy Burmy, 187. That's pretty bad. And this final one is going to be a Leafy Burmy that is a 196. I do love how common these are. If you need these shiny Burmies, this is like your best opportunity. Hopefully you have been getting lucky with these, and if you have, please let me know in the comments down below. I'd love to know which one you got. Because all in all, these are quite rare to get, and this is a 203. This is the best one of the group. Three more checks. You are a Sandy one, 195, followed up with a Leafy Leafy Cloak, 205. That one wasn't very bad. This last one isn't shiny and very bad. Starting from the bottom on this one, we get a Leafy Cloak, 200, followed up by a Trash Cloak, 199. And this last one is a Sandy Cloak. Very cool, 191. You already know the drill. Let's see what we get. This first one is a Sandy Cloak, 206. I've yet to see a hundo from one of these yet, so it would be cool to see one. This one's Trash and 204. And last but not least, we got ourselves another Sandy one at 207. Had to take a quick break to charge up the phone, but now we're good to go, and let's see what we get from these ones. Number one is a Trash Cloak 188. Not the best way to start that off, but you are another Trash Cloak, which is a 195. And this last one is a Cleaf Cloak 203. Middle on this one, what do we get? A Grass. I couldn't really tell really well because of the sun in my eyes. Next up, we have a Sandy Burmy 201. And then this last one is going to be a Trash Cloak 199. Got another random Kanto shiny here, Shiny Ponytail. Arguably one of the most beautiful shinies of all of Gen 1. 
blue fire just really works really well with it. I kind of wish that Rapid Dash kept it. Though admittedly, Rapid Dash sometimes has a good shiny sprite. Like, sometimes it's either purplish flames and sometimes it's silver. They could really go back and forth on them. But Ponyta has always been blue and it looks great. And also, eh, I mean, the top two are great. 14, 15, but then we go down to, what, well, five. Let's get at least one more shiny. Come on, this one's not it. 186. Preferably a shiny with good IVs. That would be nice. This one is Sandy, 191. And the last one will be another leafy one, 201. Starting from the bottom, we get ourselves a Sandy Cloak, 196. Then in the middle, we get our hands on a Trash Cloak, 200. And the final one is going to be another Trash Cloak, 203. Doing these ones next to construction, we got a Sandy Cloak, 189. Number two, what are you gonna be? A Leaf Cloak, 193. And this last one is a Trash Cloak, 189. Middle's gonna be a not shiny Trash Cloak, but Trash IVs too. That was really bad. This Burmy is, oh, a shiny, 187 though. So we've gotten a Trash Cloak and we've gotten a Leaf Cloak shiny in this video, so that's fun. Let's see if we can get that Sandy Cloak though. Let's check those IVs though. <laughs> 10, 11, 11, oh my. But can we back to back it? No, we cannot. 202. Let's see what these ones give us. Another shiny. Okay, 198 though, unfortunately. We're not really getting good IV shinies, but that's our second leaf cloak shiny. And the last one was a female, so let's see if this one turns into a male. It's also a female, so technically if I just wanted to have a Burmy and a Wormadam, I'd be good. Let's see what this one gives us. A Sandy Cloak, 195. And the last one is also a Sandy Cloak, 196. Let's see if this batch has another shiny. So far we've had good luck, but not with that one apparently. How about you though? Okay, leaf cloak, 200. Perhaps this last one will have a shiny. No, no Sandy Shiny yet. I do want to get that just to say that I got all three during the event. How about these three? This one is a Leaf Cloak 202. This one is a Sandy one, 193. And this one is another Sandy one, 192. Getting close to 5 p.m., which means I'm going to be heading out with Goku to the gym. But hopefully we'll get lucky with at least a couple more Shinies from these researches. But so far, man, we have not had much luck when it comes down to IVs, minus that 198%. Here we go. We got a Leafy one here. This garden has a lot of bugs in it, so hopefully that'll boost our shiny rate because there's one little mosquito that's really going for it right now but luckily he hasn't landed on me yet hey Goku how are you I'm good how are you JT I'm doing great I'm doing great we're about to do arms in a little bit obviously he has to change out of his work stuff but no gonna I'm gonna go like this uh, I mean that works you know maybe people will be asking you about tendies while you do lifts God, I hope not <laughs> anyways go ahead and check one of these three I've been saying that the shiny rates seem pretty all right so not here though 201 209 is the hundo which would be cool if we got that shiny but this is a trash cloak that is a 186 go ahead <laughs> last but not least we have a sand Candy that isn't shiny and a 189 again. Still no hundos yet, but on that note, we're gonna go to the gym. We're gonna basically just pump some iron and then I don't know exactly what I'm doing afterwards. Many hours later. Gym time is officially over. My arms are hurting, which means holding this camera is not fun. But I do have three more of these nice little Burmy quests here, so let's see what we get. This first one is a Sandy Cloak 188, followed up by another Sandy Cloak 194. And last but not least of the video, we got ourselves another Sandy Cloak and a 202, but sadly no shiny Sandy cloak this entire video but we did get three shiny burmies from not that many researches which is pretty nice and that's our grind for the day and honestly it was a pretty darn good time and we got three shiny burmies out of not that many quests so i highly recommend you work on those burmy quests if you don't have those shinies because i feel like if you just go out for a couple hours you're probably going to get one or two of them hopefully it's the one or two you need don't forget to smash that subscribe button for me show me some love and also let me know in the comments down below have you been doing any of these burmy tasks and if you have how's your luck been with them as you can see i'm doing well with it but i'd like to know how you're doing and if you're really enjoying the content and you want to see more of it i highly suggest this video over here but with that being said i'll see you in the next one